guys, I thought I would film a whole video since I did a huge order with one of my favorite online stores, CamaraDiCosmetics.com. I have bought previous items from them before and I love that store. Um, as you might know, I've done heaps of hauls with them. If you're ever looking for any Graftopian or Kylan or Benai products, any of those theatrical products that are really hard to find and overpriced in Australia, I definitely recommend checking out Camarita Cosmetics. They have great service and they are also tons cheaper than the recommended retail prices in Australia. Anyway, so this is my huge box. It is really big. So um, yeah, I'm going to start by opening it. This is an open box video. I haven't even opened this yet. I've had this for a week and I was dying to open it, but I didn't, just for you guys. So let's open it and see what we have inside. I should use a Stanley knife for this, but I'm using scissors. <laughs> So I decided to do a open box video, that way you can see exactly my reaction of the products <laughs> and uh, the way that the things were sent to me by Camera Ready Cosmetics. Uh, so these baggy things were in here, this is like that bag, like the styrofoam things, so that way nothing moves around and gets damaged. I love popping these. That's that one. And everything's individually bubble wrapped inside this huge ginormous box as well. This here is the Ben Nye Lip Colour Palette. And this is natural palette in the color natural palette. So natural colors. So the nye lipsticks. I did get some triangle foundation sponges because I use the one. I got two of these obsessive compulsive cosmetic OCC. Uh, these are the loose glitters, and this one here is in beige, and this one here is in magenta. Ooh, that's so pretty. I love glitter. Graftopian Makeup & Co. This is their uh, pressed powder, like the foundation setting powder. This is it all nicely packaged. It's all wrapped in plastic as well. And there's all just different shades for different skin tones, such as for setting bases. This is the Ben Nye Matte Foundation Professional Palette. And there's 12 refillable colors in here. This here is the Ben Nye Media Pro HD 8 color concealer and adjust the palette. So color correctors and concealers. There's just all different colors in there. So mainly for like professional use. Obviously if you're buying them for yourself, you probably wouldn't need that big array of foundation colors and concealer colors. But since I will be doing makeup on other people, I thought it would be good to have. This here is the Ben Nye Media Pro HD powder. This is like a translucent powder. I'm just picking these things out of the box as they come to me, so that's why they're a bit random. Because <laughs> this is just how I got them. This is the Ben Nye Pearl Sheen eyeshadow in the colour Sapphire. How do I open this? Oh, this case is nice. It's like a rubbery case. Very pretty blue. <laughs> I did also order a few more of the OCC lip tars. These are in the new packaging. I haven't had any in this new packaging. I have the old packaging ones, but they last forever. This is the old packaging. I'm wearing this one here, which is anime on my lips right now, actually. Um, so these are the other ones that I just got. I do have a few of them now. Uh, this one here is in Cha Cha, which is a coral. This one here is in Ophelia. Ophelia? Yeah, I think I'm saying that right. And isn't that just like a nice warm pink? And I also have this one in the colour tone, which is really nude. And so here are two more of the Ben Nye. Uh, these are the Pearl Sheen eyeshadows. Um, they weren't packaged together. This one here is in sea blue, and this one here is in turquoise. They're also in very nice packaging. I did also get a, another one of the Ben Nye lipstick palettes, and this one is in fashion. I love the way these palettes are clear. That way when I have these lipsticks in my kit, they're great to have because they're all together. 
Uh, if I'm working on multiple people, I can just like look at it, see through, and be like, I want to use that color. I think that color would be good. Instead of like having all these individual lipsticks, and as you know, like the Mac lipsticks, you can't even tell what color they are. You have to flip them all upside down and actually read them. But this way, it's very visual, and I, I like that. So, yay! I did order a few things, so it's kind of hard to remember exactly what you ordered. Uh, this one here is in mango. Oh, that's so pretty. I love that. It's kind of like a coral color. And this one here is in walnut. Those colors will definitely get some use. This is the Krylan eyeshadow base. I have already, I actually already have one here but I'm like halfway through this one and uh, I do use it every day so I got another one. I also did get this Maybon Pro coloring neutralizer so if I did ever decide to work on any green aliens or purple aliens I could just use this as their foundation. I'm joking. You probably wouldn't want to apply this all over the face but this is a neutralizing wheel so if you have any redness you will pop a little bit of this green color corrector with redness is or vice versa. If you'd like a tutorial on how to counteract and use this wheel, let me know in the comments below and I'll pick one for you. But yes, I really need one of these. <laughs> I did also get this Eve Pearl Pearlalicious Lip Gloss. How luscious does that sound? And this is in the color Full Play. Very nice. Love the packaging. Sorry these things aren't coming in order, I'm just pulling these things out of the box as I grab them. So, uh, yeah, so I have another three, three OCC Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics Glitters and they are really, really cool. This one is in red, this one is in coffee, and this one is in blue. Very original name that one is. <laughs> Like, I like when products have names that are just like blue or sea blue or coffee. Like, they actually have relativeness to the color inside the thingamabobo, inside the little kiss jar. Like, my nail polish, this is, I know I'm going to get asked. I actually got my nails done at uh, a nail place, nail technician. And um, this color here is by Trinic Lage and it's called Purple Panic. To me, this looks like pink. Love the color, but it's not purple. I also did get this Aqua Color Day Glow Effects Palette by Krylan, and I cannot wait to use these bright, vibrant colors. Booyah! Look at those. So pretty. And they are in UV, violet, pink, yellow, green, orange, and blue. I did order another one of these eyeshadow brushes because I still have one, but I want another one because I love it. This is the Pro Eyeshadow Crease Brush by Japoquisi. I can never say how to, I can never say that brand name. I know it's like, has some Japanese way of saying it, but I call it Japquisi. Tell me how you guys say it in the comments below. If you've ever used those brushes, how do you find them? I love them. So let me know what you think. I also got the Krylan Perfect Matte Primer to apply before you put on your foundation. These are Cinema Secrets Blush in Tone. Very pretty colour. I also got two of these liquid liners in black and white. This stuff looks like a little gasoline bottle, doesn't it? This has a bronzing body tint. Directions. Shake well and apply thin layers with a sponge to clean dry skin. Apply additional layers for a deeper tone. Remove with hydro cleanse or soap and water. I got some of these Ben Nye Flesh Effects Gel Burns, Laceration Scars and Wounds. Ha! Ah, special effects makeup. My favorite thing to do. So, go see how that product works. I also got another one of these Bed and I Aqua Glitters. I have this in blue and green already, and this one is in silver. So, yeah. I also did order two of the Camerady Cosmetics CRC Makeup Branded Gel Liners in Venomous, which is this gorgeous purpley kind of color. I just thought these would be good as eye bases for my tutorials. And this is in Light Cherry. Very nice, warm kind of brown colour. Even, I love the way even the brushes are bubble wrapped. 
good. Like the brushes isn't gonna the brush isn't gonna move around and break, but they still take the time to wrap everything. Even brushes in a safety box. I love this packaging, isn't that nice? This is the Jacquisi brush. Pro finishing fan, essential tool for finishing and contouring. Also, the last thing in this box is this oops, I'm just dropping everything. Ah! Um is this Cinema Secrets Metal Palette because I can now mix my products on this. I did have one in my makeup kit that I got with my school kit which was plastic and I stepped on it and cracked and it was a piece of crap. So I got a very nice shiny stainless steel. Um, as you might tell I have a new HD camera so the quality of my videos are going to be a lot better now. I have a Canon 60D, I know I'm going to get questions about it and yeah so I have a new camera now. How exciting. Anyway guys I love you all and I'll see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. In your hands, my fellow citizens, more than mine, will rest the final success or failure of our cause. Since this country was founded, each generation of Americans has been summoned to give testimony to its national loyalty. The grades of young Americans who answered the call to service surround the globe. Now the trumpet summons us again, not as a call to bear arms, though arms we need, not as a call to battle, though in battle we are, but a call to bear the burden of a long twilight struggle year in and year out, rejoicing in hope, patient in tribulation, a struggle against the common enemies of man, tyranny, poverty, disease, and war itself. Can we forge against these enemies a grand and global alliance, north and south, east and west, that can assure a more fruitful life for all mankind. Will you join in that historic effort? In the long history of the world, only a few generations have been granted the role of defending freedom in its hour of maximum danger. I do not shrink from this responsibility. I welcome it. I do not believe that any of us would exchange places with any other people or any other generation. The energy, the faith, the devotion which we bring to this endeavor will light our country and all who serve it. And the glow from that fire <laughs>